Hello, Mr. Bullet. How's my kitty? You're a good kitty. I make him smiling when I pet him when I reach for him. Just a good kitty. I just wanted to catch on video, Mr. Bullet, smiling when I, when I reach for him and pet him. I think I got it. I'll have to check the video afterwards. That was more of a cringe. Just a quick kitty. No. He's a nice old cat. You can see he leaned into my hand and licked me. He's a quick little kitty. I hate... I hate that our lifespans are short. I don't want Mr. Bullet to die. Mr. Bullet should live forever. Cat should live forever. Cat should never die. If there's any evidence against God that stands above others, it's cats having lifespans such as they do. He should be biologically immortal. They deserve it. That's a little kitty. Oh, he's 13 years old, almost. Technically, I know he was born in April 2009. And for a few more hours, in the United States at least, since it's now 7.40 p.m. Pacific time, it will be still March. 2022. In a few hours will be April Fool's Day. At which point, I don't know what the, his actual birth date is. I've put on all his documents April 4th, just so 404 file not found, since his exact birth date isn't known. But uh, sometime during this coming month, he turns 13. He'll be a teenager. He seems pretty healthy, other than his hypothyroidism. His heart murmur, which I don't think is a sign of old age. I think he's had it his whole life. I don't think it's related to the hyperthyroidism either. Because it's not myocardial hypertrophy. It's just a heart murmur caused by two leaky valves, according to his echocardiogram. Well, I guess that's it. But, uh, my point is that he might, there's no particular, there's nothing wrong with him that should shorten his lifespan. He could live indefinitely, there's no particular limit. He could live into his 30s. But that would be a long time for a cat. Most cats don't live into their 30s. And even that's not a very long time. Should be much longer. Should be until they're tired of life.